Hey Tom, Tim Archer here. Uh, like I said in the email, I run a business helping other business owners around San Diego improve their websites to get more customers. What I'd like to do is just take a couple minutes here and give you a few easy uh, pointers and some simple changes you can make to get some more customers into your painting business. Um, so here we are, ReliablePainting.com. Um, the first thing I noticed on the home page is there's actually no contact information on the home page. Uh, so if someone lands on your site and they're in, looking to get a painter right away, then they really uh, should be greeted by a big fat phone number in the top or side of the page, something that really stands out so they don't have to search too hard uh, in, or in order to get in contact with you. Um, along with the phone number, I would say maybe a, a free quote form or something that the customer can give you their contact information just in case maybe they aren't ready to commit to um, buying your service yet, but they want to find out more. And uh, having a quote form can give you their contact information, so that's a new lead that you can follow up with in the future. Um, so that's definitely the biggest rec recommendation I would have is get your contact information, your phone number on the home page. Um, moving on, the next tip I would have for you is to um, write some content for the home page as well. Content is just a fancy term for writing. Right now there's no writing on your home page, which um, is okay in terms of visuals, but the thing with uh, home pages are when Google um, searches your website and it doesn't find any content or writing on your home page, it's less likely to show your business in the search results. So uh, when someone goes to Google and searches for uh, painters San Diego the only way to get down in these organic results down here is to have content or writing on your website that relates to painters in San Diego same thing goes for any other search terms as well I've actually got a program here and it tells me um, exactly what terms people are searching for and it tells me how many searches those specific keywords are getting so approximately, um, approximately 2,900 times per month, someone is searching for interior paint on Google. So by having content on your site that relates to interior paint, Google's more likely to uh, show your website when someone searches for interior paint. So that's definitely another key recommendation I have for you is getting some content on your homepage. Bare minimum, I would say you want 500 words, but the more is the better. So if you can hit a thousand or more, that's awesome. Um, if you're a writer naturally yourself, that's great. Um, if not, I do have um, some professional writers that uh, I have do the writing for me. So that's one thing I can offer you. We can also do some research to find out what searches people are or what keywords people are searching in Google then we can get those specific terms up on your site and then when anyone searches for them your site's going to show up in the search results the next recommendation I have for your site would be um, I'm not sure if you're familiar with what's called mobile friendly but right now when someone uh, goes onto your site from a cell phone it's not very easy to navigate. It's actually pretty difficult. If we close the browser size down to um, that of a smartphone, so like iPhone size, about right here, you can see that to get through the site, someone has to scroll left and right, side to side, up and down, and they're not really able to find what they're looking for on the site. So as a, as a user, that can be somewhat frustrating, and it makes it more likely for the customer to leave your site. Um, the second problem with not having a mobile friendly site though is if we go to Google uh, they actually have their own test for mobile friendliness and I went ahead and entered your URL in the in this test and analyzed it you can see this is Google's actual test not just something I made up um, but when we ran the test your site comes out as not mobile friendly so the text is too small to read uh, the links are cl too close together, so someone's not be going to be able to uh, press the links. 
And the reason that's no good is because if you want to be listed in the uh, local search results, so the, the results in this map up here, the only way to get up there is to have a mobile-friendly site and to have content on your homepage. So those are definitely two big recommendations I have for you. If you have a web guy already, I would tell him to get your site mobile-friendly ASAP because that's costing you a lot of business every day. And there's also a couple other factors in your site that we can change that will result in uh, you being up on this front page and that's just going to help you get more visibility to your business. Um, if these are some things you're interested in having done for you, by all means, I'd love to help you out. Uh, what I'm going to do is list my contact information below the video. Uh, so if you're interested, get in touch with me and we can definitely um, make some improvements and get more customers into your painting business. And Tom, I'd like to thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. And hopefully you can take a couple things away from here that you can implement right away and uh, makes a big difference for you. So thanks again and hope to hear from you too, Tom.